Well, let's try again. Good morning, guys, and uh, welcome back. Ah, it's really windy and cold outside. It's only 11 degrees and it's <laughs> 9 a.m. Um, not a really pleasant weather. The wind is very sharp. I quickly done uh, my check and uh, I'm on a way. Get a bit south, maybe better weather, maybe worse, don't know. We'll uh, find out, eh?
Great chassis of fuel guys now. He'll be coming up to a front way, Mickey, uh, shortly. So you asking me, Bob? Hey, Roger, the wind um, pulling you back a bit? Ah, uh, the wind is, yeah, oh, I'm still a bit over half tank, so yeah, you should be all right. See how we're going, we're going to get close to Camarina, if they have to, I'll put a splash in there.
can I go off road without getting bogged?
can't see them yet, but this is the safest I can go. Because after this, I can see them coming. Not 
have that uh, high value bright how the parking bay looks in a uh, queue may have a early lunch to get in there too much mud I'll just park on this side Okay, let's go out of here. So bloody cold. Oh. Once I start walking towards the shop, I realize that I done the biggest mistake not putting the jumper on, but the nah. Of this, I'm not turning back. Now I go, but uh, yeah, Ooh. that was cold.
like they did a bit of work on the islands again, new plants. It's a pity that the weather turned bad all of a sudden. Council is really doing a good job in here. They really trying to keep this little town clean as much as they can. south of Pine Pines, you have to come all the way here to Mount Magnet, turn towards Geraldton and to Yang Lu and from there turn uh, left again to Golden Grove and coming back the same way.
which one you will get to Uban.
Roger. Everything wheels up. 
and the company is not going to be impressed with me for doing that that's for sure so yep when it's like that and not much of a shoulder and to drop the speed oh well just around the corner
have a look around the back and if there's nothing there then I'll just drop it here in the middle. spot at the back of room for a single trailers but uh, not for triples my other option was to go here in the middle in between the dolly and the tarp trailer
Can run the edge of the black for us, please, southbound. Thanks, mate. <laughs> Not the only one.
All right, let's go home. So, this is a new addition. Yeah, what I'm getting is 
around $300 a month. It's not a big deal. But it's not a, for me, it's not about the money. For me, it's more about, you know, to keep me busy, to keep me happy on the road, to do what I like to do. So, <laughs> yeah. I'm still a beginner of, uh, on uh, applying this uh, thing so uh, it will take me a while to fine tune my movements but uh, slowly slowly I'll be getting there at least for the first time since I bought it without any testing before this was the first test I lifted off the ground fly around landed safe didn't crash it which it's good thing well it's also good that it's got a uh, landing assist and uh, takeoff assist but if you do a wrong movement you may have a chance to crash it so what really good about this uh, DJI Mini 4 Pro is that uh, it's got 360 degrees obstacle avoid avoided it's avoiding all the obstacles all around up down it's yeah it's got his own cushion if uh, you have the choice what to do if it's an obstacle to stop or to go around it so uh, it's not gonna go into a tree or into anything when it's flying it's just slowing down scanning and I got the setup will go around so yeah it is a peace of mind but again if you put it on a sports mode that cancel everything it's flying a lot faster it's going 60 kilometers an hour but it's canceling all the sensors and everything so uh, you have to watch out not to have anything on his path and also he's got the return to home function which you press the button and it's coming back to you from where uh, it's been uh, taking off I didn't have a chance to test that one how accurate it is but from what other people are saying it's within a few inch from yeah another thing that I had to get now it's a uh, plastic pad to have with me about a meter by a meter store it behind the cap somewhere because yeah you can't use it uh, on a grass on a, a sand uh, on dirt because all that is eventually clogging up the motors and damaging everything so this is, is what I was talking yesterday that I've been trying to do something, I've been trying to do something but I don't want to, didn't want to say last night, I didn't want to spoil the surprise well this was the surprise alright you know I was so excited to after I had uh, something to eat test the drone and I forgot to make a coffee 
and now I'm not gonna stop I'm not gonna stop to make another coffee I'm only three hours from there so Top and a princess Yeah Stopping to buy a coffee uh, is not in my agenda. Especially lately, it's more and more expensive. And not only that, there are not that many good places to buy. And especially between here, from Uban to Perth, the only place I can stop this bloody thing is in Moshe. can't stop anywhere else and but even if I stop by the time I get to be done everything is just shut but there's no parking in being done so it's not helping much well talking about coffee <laughs> I don't mind if you guys Hit me with a cup of coffee from time to time. Get one of that. Thank you stickers. And offer me a cup of coffee. I don't mind that. Only joking. Uh, yeah, so I uh, think uh, is. With a new run I'm still not 100% uh, adapted to. It's Thursday, I'm going home, I feel very weird. Because usually I'm not going home. I wasn't going home until Friday, so now going Thursday. Uh, will still be a couple of months before my wife can uh, change her schedule to be off every second Friday because her, she done her schedule that way that she was uh, off every second Monday when I was home now to change to Friday may take a while so uh, yeah tomorrow I'll be home alone not that I don't have anything to do oh yeah plenty to be done but not in a best mood because I'm not adapted yet to be home Friday and do housework I'm still into the mood of driving so next uh, trip will be Monday just pray to God that I don't have to to, to, to live again around mid, midnight because that definitely it's stopping up everything for me
even if um, the road work will be finished around here completely I don't think they will change the speed limit on this uh, section of the road because it's too many merging lines and stuff like that and yeah will create too much drama since bad people have no idea how to merge Especially if it's traffic, they're on a merging line, they see the traffic is moving slowly, instead of taking the first opportunity to merge, they go all the way to the end of the line, next car behind him, the same, the same, and they are all blocking the line there. battery out and cut all the power to try to do a cold reset to see what happened when I was gonna pull the battery out I couldn't it was jammed in finally I managed to take it out and it was not square anymore it was round like a almost like a blurry balloon it wasn't long before it was gonna explode Just uh, watch out for this lithium batteries. How you store them, how you charge them, because they are big hazard. we started all right guys so you have a great weekend stay safe out there thank you for coming for another trip and uh, see you Monday night when I go back to Port Hedland Till then, you take care and see you then.